Hi guys, thanks for stopping by. My name is Jurgen and today I have a Jordan 3 to review. But first, if this is your first time here, give it a subscribe below and do not forget to follow me on my Instagram. Let's read this label. The label reads Air Jordan 3 Retro and the color code is black, cord purple and cement gray. I have my typical size and that's a 9, US 9. Typical for a Jordan 4s, I go in half size up so a nine and a half for but for jordan threes i go for my true size let's open this box you have that elephant print tissue paper then you have the normal tissue paper and then you have this beautiful shoe let's get them out of the shoe box here you go the Jordan 3 court purple this sneaker released on the 21st of November and I must say I'm not the biggest Jordan 3 fan uh, I have one pair, that's the uh, fragment, the white fragment pair, and I like to have the black cement, um, but that's it. I have not seen a lot of colors that I like, but in fact, this colorway I like. It's a purple shoe, uh, mostly black with purple and with the black cement. I like purple on shoes, so uh, that's a plus. Uh, so for me, this is a nice colorway. Let's begin with the outsole. That's I think the most interesting color blocking because you have this orange or infrared color right there with a the purple and the gray. I, I like I like this color blocking. I really like it. Then you have the midsole. It's a white midsole, um, and the panels is mostly black with the elephant print and the purple right there on the shoe box you see a little bit more of that elephant print uh, and the black on the other side it's the same and on the back side you see the jordan logo right there i saw some something awkward with my shoe I don't think you can see it but this tab it's centered but the heel is leaning toward the left of me and I'm I'm not able to fix this so that's a bummer I prefer my shoes to be perfect because you pay the jackpot for shoes in these days so so when i see something like that i think like come on just check those damn shoes but uh, to continue the review you have the black laces on this shoe you do not have extra laces it, it would be interesting if nike uh, gave us some extra laces in this color I think that will pop out like crazy we have the purple Jordan logo right there with that infrared lining on the logo black tongue infrared on the inside of the tongue on the color it's gray and last but not least you have some hits of gray on the upper of the shoe left right and in front 
So as I was saying, I like this color blocking. On my Instagram, I posted a picture with this shoe and the court purple Jordan 1. And most of the people said that they like this above the Jordan 1 court purple. I am more a Jordan 1 fan, so for me, I would pick the court purple Jordan 1. Um, but in fact this is really a good colorway the materials on the jordan 3 are always spot on this is some good leather uh, so yeah color blocking for me i would give this an eight and a half and um, quality the quality is is is, is perfect i would give that a nine so overall, this shoe deserves an eight and a half in total. The prices of this sneaker are somewhat like retail, uh, $190 or 190 euros. And you can pick this up on StockX for around $200. Or maybe if you get lucky, uh, you can pick this up for retail on StockX. Then you have the fees, so you will pay a little bit, bit more than when you buy it for retail in the shop. But maybe you can find this on local for the same price. So yeah, check it out and maybe you are lucky. So yeah, this is fire shoe. I really like it. And I will put these on and give you an on-feed review right now. For now, I will say later.